Okay, let's do another one to find out what's the energy going on surrounding. I say, guess we'll say, what's the energy going on with the Divine Feminine and her karmic masculine? Okay. And just for the record, I don't read tarot cards, okay? I use them, but I don't read them. So, I feel like something has backfired. And somebody is receiving karma. <coughs> Some secrets has come out. Ace of Cups reverse. Queen of Cups. Ace of Swords. So it could be a um the karmic energy that somebody could be dealing with could be a um Cancer, Pisces, or Scorpio, or you could be one of these signs. Um, some sort of sex, um, secrets has came out. Deception, secrets has come out when it comes to this Queen of Wands. Now, this Queen of Wands energy could be your person's person. It could be your family member. This could be a neighbor. This could be your friend. But somebody was, was plotting now, somebody could be plotting something on the Queen of Cups. Somebody could have been planning to keep a Queen of Cups hanging, or a Queen of Cups could have been planning on keeping somebody hanging. This karmic energy, or whoever this energy is, they're feeling like they're not being recognized. Um, this energy could have been doing something deceptively. For a masculine energy to overlook you, okay? Or this was her plots and her plans. Okay, so tell me about this Ten of Wands in reverse. It's a masculine energy. He is given, he is, uh, Giving a rest on the situation with this karmic energy. No emotions for this karmic energy. He has withdrew everything. He's not even working on the situation with this karmic energy. And this is karma for her. Something came out. Okay. When it came to her in this mask. What was the deception? She was doing some sort of um, spell work because she's wounded. She's a backwards ass witch, whoever this is. She throws spell work and is backwards and is returning back to sender. Clarify the judgment. This, this karmic energy don't want to accept the defeat. She don't want to accept defeat. And she's basically still trying to, you know, produce a war with a feminine energy. And she's losing a battle. Okay. Some sort of gossip. Um, somebody could be somebody could be crying over spilled milk, um, having major regrets, shit backfiring on them. She could have been trying to whatever the magic she was doing. It was some sort of spell work. She tried to do some shit on this masculine's dick. Okay, she wanted this masculine to be taking care of her. Okay. This is a very superficial individual, and her secrets are coming out. For some of you, your masculine could have been in the Marines, in the military, in the Army.
So we got a king of swords out here. This could be your energy. You could be dealing with the air sign. You could be dealing with the cancer, Pisces, or a Scorpio. Some of you could be a teacher. Ten of Wands out here twice, so something came to an end. What is these endings? Clarify the 1010. <laughs> so this 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 karmic energy. If they own, if they're an entrepreneur or they own their business or something, they losing that motherfucker. Okay, and this is karma for them. So it's a karmic karmic energy losing her losing her business because she tried to do something energetically towards you, divine feminine. If you had a business and you lost your business behind this person energetically attacking you, they're about to lose theirs or they have already lost theirs. Yep, and they stuck. The Hierophant. So you could be a spiritual teacher. And this, this karmic energy could have been gossiping about you. She could have been going around lying on you, he or she. Um, secretly lying on you and your masculine. This karmic energy could be saying that she's she's um she owns your masculine's penis. Okay. She's his queen. But he's not putting no more work into effort into the relationship with her because uh shit. I see this ace of wands out here. She could have been secretly fucking somebody else. She was fucking a, a Leo or your person could be a Leo. Somebody is studying. This karmic is, you know, she sat around and waited for this masculine. You know, she's secretly waiting for this masculine to, to come in and, um, Show her some emotions or something, but her her spell work is in the, in reverse, and it's not gonna work if this masculine knows about it, and now she's stuck. karmic energy is losing money trying to make a divine feminine stuff her secrets then came out what are the secrets wow that she's an evil witch high priestess in reverse so this masculine he's found out that this karmic in oh and she was doing something she was doing some sort of spell work or manipulation um, she was trying to do something to this masculine sacral chakra. She's trying to learn how to do something to this masculine sacral chakra. And that's his penis. Okay. Somebody could have, you know, this, this karmic energy, she could be trying to send somebody to tell you some gossip or something about this masculine. Um, with her, you see how she's holding this chemistry bottle in her hand, some sort of concoction. She's hold she's doing something. Okay. She's trying to learn some shit. She's trying to learn and how to figure out something she can do to this masculine's dick so his dick won't get hard. 
she's getting karma for that shit. Your masculine could be in the military. He could be in the army or the Marines. Okay? But she's trying to do something because she's evil. Tell me more. Yeah, she's defeated. And she could be she could be having heavy menstrual cycles, or you could be divine feminine. For this karmic, this could be karma for her. For her trying to um keep this masculine's dick from getting erection. She could be bleeding real heavy. Okay. So basically, like if she if if, if she's like saying or doing things saying, okay, well. I hope he don't he don't never get a a, a hard on again because what what he did to me or what she did in this backfiring and it's backfiring to her to where now she's bleeding real heavy. So if if you on your period you can't fuck unless you're a nasty motherfucker, you know. Um, this karmic she can't do shit just like she's saying this masculine can't do nothing. All of this because he's ghosting her, the hermit out here. Mm -hmm. Why is this masculine ghost in this karmic? That has came out many times. Why is he ghost in this karmic energy? He feels this is justice. So the best way for him to, to give her karma is to get the fuck away from her. Because this is somebody who probably, you know, wanted this masculine to be doing everything to take care of her. Um, she's doing some sort of spell work and manipulation and it's backfiring. Now this masculine left her. It's all about the fire and the passion. Yeah, so she's she's trying to do something to this masculine, some sort of spell work, so his dick can't get hard. But what these karmics don't understand, they can do all the spell work they want towards a masculine. His dick just ain't going to get hard for her. And the shit is backfiring. It's still going to get hard for his divine feminine. Okay. The fool. So this karmic energy is doing all of this because this masculine is taking a new beginning or a new leap of faith with, with somebody else or he's getting back with his divine feminine. And he wants ten of cups. So this karmic energy is trying to do something to this masculine so his dick won't get hard. Use a, use a, uh, uh, <laughs> I ain't even going to talk about you. You should, do it. you got, you got enough self-hate. I don't, my little words ain't going to help you. I mean, ain't going to hurt you because you hate yourself. Okay? Anybody that would do some shit like this is, is hateful. She mad because she been laying in her bed, in the bed with her legs open, ready for this masculine. And he don't want it. And either he don't want it or she on her period and she can't give him none. And he's not recognizing her ass no more. He don't see her as the trophy that he thought that she, you know, well, well, reserved, well deserved to be held in high honor. He's not holding her ass in high honor. Mm -mm. She's broken hearted. Three of swords in reverse. Where she wanted divine feminine to be broken hearted over this masculine. Not getting an erection where this bitch is, is doing spell magic over his dick. But baby, it still gets hard for me. I just want to let you know. It still get hard for me. She watching his ship sail away. Mm -hmm. Tell me more. <laughs> the universe is laughing at her. Mm -hmm. Yep, laughing at her. And this is a karmic that's always a bridesmaid and never a bride. She's always, you know, trying to get somebody to marry her. She's always running after the bouquet. She go to all of her friends. All her friends is possibly married. And she's not.
she wanted this masculine to be stingy with you, but he's not. She didn't want this masculine to give to you intimately, but he is. And she was secretly trying to do some, some magic on this masculine so his dick won't get hard. Or she's, she's feeding him some shit. She's feeding this masculine... Damn, she's feeding this masculine something. You know, like what they give the, the women in prison so they don't be horny and shit. Or they give the men. I don't know. I ain't never been to prison. So I don't know. But I've heard stories that they... Is it salt Peter? Soft Peter. For your dick to be soft. <clears throat> yeah. Okay, so... Clarify, how is this masculine? What's going on between this masculine and this karmic? Or the feminine and the karmic? The roles can be reversed. It doesn't matter if you're... I'm, I'm saying masculine because I'm a feminine. But the roles can be reversed, okay? I could be saying um, him and it could be a her in your case. Okay? Something has come to a major end, a major ending. Okay, this is death. What is this ending about? You guys, if you guys want, would like to uh, make a donation to me, I greatly appreciate it. I'm so hungry right now. They they helped me pay for my room here, and I'm supposed to be moving out, moving into my place next week. But I need help with um, me some food. For me and my two sons, I'm asking everyone to donate to me. Um, if you don't want to donate, you can purchase one of my spiritual bath mixes or a t-shirt for me or a hoodie to help support me and support my channel. And I thank you in advance. Yes, yeah, she don't, even though it's an ending, this, this karmic energy don't want this masculine to walk away from her. Okay. So if you're if you you don't want him to walk away and you're doing magic on his dick, his dick ain't gonna work for you. What's going on with the masculine's dick when it comes to this karma? That's just me nosy. What's going on with the masculine's dick when it comes to this karma? He has no wisdom or no, or no knowledge. That this karmic is doing this to keep him from walking away. Oh, I feel sick to my stomach. Tell me more, spirit. How is, what's going on with this masculine's dick when it comes to this karmic? What's going on with the masculine's dick when it comes to this karmic? What's going on with the masculine's dick when it comes to this karmic? No joy, no, he's not relaxed. There's no harmony when it comes to him. So if, if, if he's not happy, his dick ain't happy. <laughs> he's being stingy with her. <laughs> he's not giving her the dick. He's being stingy with his dick, but he knows that she don't want to go nowhere, so, and don't want him to go nowhere, so he's not giving to her energetically. He don't need her. <laughs> he feels like he don't need her, and she don't need him. She don't need his dick. He don't need her pussy. Basically, that's what he's saying. But see, she wants this masculine to submit to her. Even though it's the man holding the woman, this woman wants this masculine to submit to her. And see, she's been trying to throw shit over, over his home. If you live with your masculine or your feminine, this person has been trying to throw energetically throw shit, attacks over your house, but it's in reverse. And she's mad because this masculine is bored and satisfied and don't want nothing with her. So she's steady trying to roll strikes at you like she both. 
but she's not having no success with it. Mm -mm. This masculine still is not, you know, given to her emotionally. And this is karma for her. Because he don't need her. And for some of you, um, this karmic been playing with, with Ouija boards and shit. She's been in a secret competition with you. Mm-hmm. And it's all it's doing is getting her and this masculine into disagreements and arguments. He's not including her in the finances. She's losing sleep. He's not falling for the mind manipulation no more. And she was warned not to do it and she didn't listen. So now she's getting karma. Where this masculine is having new opportunities of money. <laughs> money. He's not her twin flame and this shit is backfiring. She wanted this masculine to be stuck. She didn't want him and you to have a ten of cups. Now she's sitting up drinking. Mm-hmm. She's stuck. She hasn't been awakened to the fact that all the chaos and conflict that she's sending to you is going back. Because she's a dark, evil witch. You pulled the swords out of your back and walked away from the situation when it comes to her. But she's like patiently waiting for you to go broke. Mm-hmm. She's doing spell work on your finances and it ain't working. It's going back to her. This is a queen of wands um, giving your masculine bad advice. And she's, he's still not taking her off. She wants something to come to an end between you and your masculine. Okay. She's plotting. She's probably going to end up in some sort of mental en entrapment. We have trickery. Affection. The Archangel right here and this this karmic is losing sleep, which she wanted you to be. You're not running from no new beginning. You're running to a new beginning. And this person wanted your person to be trapped or confined to them. Okay. And your masculine didn't have the truth and clarity that this person wanted you to be stuck. But he, and she was still constantly trying to throw chaos and conflict at you. And there's karma. Okay. She didn't want this masculine to make a long-term investment in you. So she started messing with candles and shit for his dick not to get hard. Um, messing with concoctions. Um, she probably trying to rub shit on this masculine, wanting him, you know, wanting you to be given to him and him not to be given to you. It's not a tower moment. She's a third party situation and she's not having no success because now this masculine has ghosted her. And you're not defeated. She got caught doing something when she was trying to get away with. But you you trusted your gut. And you know that this person was doing something to this masculine. And then he was coming back to check to see if it worked. If it worked. Okay. She was manipulating him. And she was doing this because this she's threatened by your gifts and your talent. And this masculine is not coming back and forth. Going back and forth. You know, being intimate with her no more. He's not taking care of her no more. He's looking forward to a two of cups with his divine feminine. Okay. And this person is, is being stingy and obsessed with money when it comes to this karmic energy. So now she's trying to get she's trying to get advice because she's a wounded warrior. Okay? She's she's trying to still attack you where this masculine don't want her. So I'm gonna stop it right there. Cause I gotta go to the bathroom and I'll see you in the next read. Peace out.